Alrighty. Um, so today we're going to try to see if we can get into some trains. I want to see if we can do this. Now, um... Now, this is going to be that train station. I want to see how... See what we... Uh... Okay, so we do need to have a train station. We're going to put two sets of tracks here. Okay. And then, basically, we are going to have two sets of tracks here. We can easily take that. We can easily take it take that and go there and then have this um the reason why i'm having two sets of tracks is because we can also have wood uh we could go with i th yeah i think that should be okay um can i reconfigure this to sell I'm going to definitely reconfigure this. Um, go with the cargo station. And then basically we needed to come over here to the tools. Okay. Now this... Now, in order for us to build here, um, I want to see how far we can, okay, so we do got some new trucks here. I don't see the problem is I don't want to Yeah. It's going to cost us 259 here to to do that. We can go with 120 and we can get it down to be a cheaper Um, well, we can get it, we can get it, and if we need to, we can expand through it, um, a little bit backwards a little bit, but I don't think, okay. Okay, because we got new trucks here, guys. We're going to try. You know, we paid 5500 in that. In this.
even if we say if we say no it'll drop it down a little bit now yes we could go with high speed but for now um, even if we upgrade it to high speed it's going to be more expensive right now. Okay, no. Okay. Because where we need to go with this is we have to go over here. Um, so I don't know why I decided to go around this way when you could have just gone this way. But having less... You know what? Let's borrow that 500 back. Uh, let's accept that there and then Okay. Okay. So this means now we have a thing that can deliver the wood to the tools, whereas we can have wood that goes from here down to here effective. Um, now, we would only be having one train here. One train here. And I'm going to probably put it um, away from... Because we could put it right next to it, but it's not going to work that... It's not going to look that great. So let's go... Let's put it out a little bit of considerable distance. Just so that it can go there and then too much curvature. Now we have to make sure that we grab the proper stuff. So we are kind of getting into trains today, but I don't think we'll be able to survive with the train. Because uh, we got to have, we also got to be able to set up the wood to process down here to work on the wood processing. So, you know, and trains are expensive, guys. Trains are definitely an expensive endeavor. Okay. Because if we go over here um, for the train depot, okay, if we buy vehicles, um, now, mind you, vehicles are a mil can be, um, this box car, it's expensive, guys, look at this, tanker car, like, 
it's expensive to get into this. And, you know, even to go with this thing that can pull top speed of 64 miles per hour, you know, you know, looking at the, you know, even going with this Russian clash, which is a night, which ends in the 27th of next year. You know, this thing, you know, even with the going with this one, which ends in 1940, which pulls more power. So, you know, if we add that on to it and then not going with passengers, we would, we have a box car there and a box car that's capacity of 12. I'm going to go one, two, three. Yeah, it's going to cost us three million buckaroos just for us to... Yeah, even that's expensive, you know. It's going to become expensive, guys. So even if I borrowed enough to buy the vehicle... Okay, even if I borrowed enough to buy three of these and to have that, it's not going to do us any good. Any <laughs> good. We could go with the lower capacity boxcar. One, two, three. Which that's only going to give us 2,000. 2,000. If we borrow one two three four five it might be worth But as you can see, one of our you can go at seventy five, which is engine type steam, uh four hundred and sixty UR. Okay, we can add you and then we don't have any diesel. None of it's a cargo. So let me add one, two, three for that. Now we could go with, um, if we go with the add one, two, we couldn't even get that in. Uh, we could go with, we could go with one of those and then add 12, make it a little bit of a variety. Just say that we got a new box car, new box car. So that train's going to be sitting in the depth in the depot for a little bit collecting dust right now. Cuz yeah, we're playing a lot in interest, but once we get the uh we just need to have a buildings. Let's go truck and we don't need uh let's go with left here. And what we're going to do is we'll expand it to 20 millimeters. So what I'm confused as to okay, so in order to do this, it has it's gonna cost us seventy five in order to do this. So we're gonna do that and then we need to go street roads.
okay? Which, to be frank, we have to kind of use... I'm going to try to take it down as low as we can. Yeah. So, yeah. So, country road there, which... Which... We are making money, guys. So once we get this done, I think we will be able to... I don't want to... Okay, we'll borrow one more just so that we can get this thing built. The way that it needs to be done. Okay, now we already have the depot there. So we'll use this depot. Since we don't need another depot, we'll use this one. Okay, so we need to create a line. Um, new line. Central South to the Central Factory. Okay, for that one. Another new line. Sancho down to Shinani, okay? Now, we actually do need to click on this line and add this station there, okay? Because it's train. And then we have to create another uh, another um, let's go with road. We're also going to use that same method over here we're going to probably end up using this one here to come over here. Here. So now we do need. So if we can connect it right there without having to do anything, we'll come connect and buy from over here when we do buy vehicles. For not for here. Not for here, we'll buy it from there, and then this one will be bought for down over here. Okay, so, now, what we need to do is, um, now, we could easily, um, connect from right there down to there, just to make so that when you do come in, it will be a lot easier to get people without having to go around into the city. Um... If um, it's only if So that way, then when cars do, they don't have to make a, and we'll do a can, and then, so that they still, um, so they can come through directly in that way, without having to go through a lot of the city, just, you know, they have to go that way, but that'll make it better, I guess. Um, okay, so now we need to go. Um, we already got the train depot running. We need to go over here. Okay. We have, um...
Okay. We got the Ducks, which is going to end in 1932. Um, I'm looking at the NM first. So, if that one is on the Benz truck, said seven, that only holds six. But that power is capacity for seven. And we're going to be hauling logs of wood. Um, we could easily do uh, these slide stakes, which is basically so. Let's go one, two. We only can buy two, to be honest with you. Let's borrow one more. Um, let's buy four, five for these. Okay, we're going to set you to um, going to set all of you guys. We need to set these guys down here to Line one. Okay. Now, this line one is going to be logs. Um, it's going to be show sheet. So it's going to basically we need. So we're going to do S U Z H O U Sochi Forest to. So we'll just call this one Shoshi Forest Mill. Um, hold on. Yoko Manager. Um, Shoshi Forest Mill. Okay. Then. Uh, we're going to create this line here is going to go Soshi uh, to Chernobyl, Chanel Tools Factory. So we'll say, we'll just say, um, we'll just call this one uh, G H E N. N A I Chanel uh well Chanel Tools. We'll just call this one Chanel Tools. One um there. Okay. Then we need one that's going to take this. Um, we need to find buildings. So that's where the tool... That's... Um, that's where they load off the trucks for that. I'm going to set up one that's going to load off... Uh, Gonna load off the tools there. So this one, um, we need to create a line. New line from Chennai Exchange to that there. So that means, um. Um, so this here, uh, we're going to say, so this is going to be, uh, C H E N N A I tool drop, tool drop. Okay. Tool drop. So that means that that's going to be the tool drop. That's where tools are going to go from here. 
down into the thing there. So now we need to go over here. That is all of them. We need to go to Uh, is that the color? No, that's the ho. Oh, that's the tram depot. That's the train depot. That's the Soshi depot, which basically they're going to be going from all the way over there down to there. How much does it require for me to build a road depot? 14. If that's the case, then we'll just build another road depot. Um, that's steel planks and construction materials. Um, we're going to use the AMF 15 Tranquil truck. Um, now this is only carrying six. That's only carrying seven. Uh, we'll do the Ben's tranquil truck because basically we're taking tools, right? So yeah, go one, two, three, and then we need to find tool drop. Okay. Okay, it's going to have, wait a minute, did I, why is it putting plastic on this thing? Um, maybe once it gets. Overview. So yeah, no, it only talks about plastic, which it's not plastic. It will probably... Um... No, okay. So Shochi Forest Mill. Okay. So Shochi Transfer... Um, will not load anything. It basically... Because there's going to be no loading there. It's basically supposed to drop off and pick up. Now, we still have these vehicles sitting here. So, we need to find... Shoshi Forest Mill. So yeah, we're not going to be making money if we fail this, guys. Then we... Basically, that train's only got uh, three cars on it. Which, to be honest with you, is not making us really much of anything.
No. Look at the details of the car. Oh, it needs to take plan uh, 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 managed vehicle. Manage, modify. I made that mistake. It does not need boxcar. Edit selected vehicle. It needs to send planks. Two. Can we throw three on there? No, if we're making money, guys, then... You know, we need to uh, add. Basically, it's costing us six, seven, six, eleven. I'm going to borrow ten. Um, manage the vehicle. Black car with stakes. Thank you. Okay. Now, once we start repaying, we'll be able to repay it off. Because right now, we're getting that sawmill. We're getting the sawmill. We're getting the tools to Shawnee now. So, it will help. We will be getting... We're, getting, we're earning money. Earning money. And with that train only being like that way that it is, um, can I manage the vehicle? Can I add two? Can I add one more to this?
But once we get this thing over here, I think once we get that, we want to make sure that we are... We've got 63 waiting for pickup. And we have 59 of that. There. And I would... Love to add more. Because if we can replace that, like right now we're using. I believe we are. What train are we using? The, we're using this one. Which this one. You know, we're using that one. That one's fine. But if we can use the SH one, like, things are starting to get more rounded down to being expensive. But I think going... We would like to get that a little bit faster time. But we just don't have the... So it's basically just going to be playing cat and mouse. <laughs> yep. Not actually going to make us some money there. So we got our first set of train, train settings. Now if I could get two of those and have one going from here and going, you know. Fuso B46. So yeah, so we are making money, guys. You know, right now, I would probably like to repay some of my loans off. If we can start repaying the loans off, like, yeah, we're at 10000 but, you know. At what point? So it's 50, it's running 50 miles an hour with what we've got on it. Um, so, it has a little bit more pulling power. Um, that's, so capacity right now, it's good quality, um, uh, it's good quality. Um, let's add the new flight stakes and we'll put, um, Put you up in front. Um, and remember, if this one's holding seven, we can at uh, least get rid of, we can uh, modify it by getting rid of one. And we can add that additional capacity for the first one to make sure that, you know, getting a little bit more to travel. But we're getting a hundred there, and we're only carrying seven, fourteen, twenty-one, seven, fourteen, twenty. We're only carrying so twenty-one plus twelve, which is seven, fourteen, twenty-one, twenty-eight, thirty-three. We're carrying thirty-three of those goods. From there to there. And. You know. And it does not have very much turv curvature. It can carry 33 of that. And it's going 50 miles an hour. Right now.
And if we can get more... I'm trying to see if we can replace them slowly with the new... new so we're getting 38 now. Rather than... If I can get more... You know, we're getting... We would need another train here if we need to deliver more of that over there. You know... You know, so we will modify it as we, on our way back, we'll modify it. If we could get us cloned of this train, you know, we would get a clone if we could get it so that we can have where, where right here, um, it would actually come through pretty much most of the way, except it would come what somewhat over here, just a little bit, so it's just dual trains going. Not double, but dual. You know, it's not making us money. A lot of money. If we can double the train up, it's... That's kind of why... Um, you know, if we can... You know, even if we added side stake to it, it's going to be expensive to even add that in. To add another one of those in. And so... What we want to do is we want to... Uh, if the train can go 50 miles an hour... You know, it's delivering us that much... much if we can do that and then you know we're we're modifying Now, if I add that there and remove that. Um, we're not going to be able to. Even with that modification. Three, and then we got a smaller because if we can start like you know we're getting 43 as long as we can manage the vehicle okay I would I'm adding an additional one. It's going to cost us that much even to modify it. So no, it's not going to be... We're getting 48 per trip. And we need to increase that time. That modified that time. As you can see, it's taken us 11 minutes just to deliver that much. You know, well, being able to double that down, uh, once this gets over here, we're modifying the vehicle again just to get more. We want to make sure that we can modage very poor. Okay, so we're going to modify, edit the selected vehicle. We're going to clear this one out, and then we'll add an additional It's 40. 
eight miles an hour. And it, it's going 75 back. Condition is very good. Details. It's Metacore on its way going back, but I think, you know, you know, it's going to be Metacore on its way there. But I think we should be a okay. Not. Like, if it's good... Yeah, and as you can see, we would probably, once this one, we'll probably double up on the trains or fix all of our, most of our vehicles. The train here is doing us good, but I, we need more. But this one, I'm not going to modify it any further. We're going to keep the train the way it is. Sorry, I hit my mic. Uh, sorry about that. Uh... I'm trying not to, because, you know, my mic being the way it is. Now, we we're starting to receive more in terms of money being aligned. So, we're going to start with the... With the Shinahi oil, with the Shinahi tools. Um, okay, so what I need to do is ground... Vehicles first off. Manage vehicles ground only. So if there are none. Okay. We're going to replace these selected vehicles. Has to be cargo. These are the NW first trucks. Um, I would like to see if we can get the Ben's Tranquil trucks, because those are going to be... These guys are ending their life soon anyway. Anyway, and that's going to cost us 9550 to do this. Um, we also got this one here, which can hold up to six, but is... Uh, but can go 40 kilometers, this can go 20 so if we can even, I would love to go with this, but that's going to be Opal Benz. That's going to be even more expensive. So uh, what are we, what are we doing over here anyway? This is fuel, right? So here comes our another load for our train. Okay, Shinaihi fuel. Now the Shinaihi fuel, which I believe is right here. Shinashi Waypoint. Shinai Fuel. Um, I believe... Yeah, so those guys got a boost. Um... Of a fuel drop, which is this yellow line. 
um, which is this green line here for drop off. Those need those. Um, okay, the yellow line is going to need to be replaced. Okay, these guys are taking fuel, I believe. So even um, even if we go with the 40 kilometers, yeah, it's going to improve on our speed in Hihu. It's going to cost us 1,000 to complete it, though. Which, to be honest with you... Um, wait. So if these are only going to cost us 40... Uh, was going to go 40 miles an hour. Can we cut this down in half? Take three of these. Um, just enough to where... Um, because see, if we have how many vehicles? We have eight selected, and we drop four off. I think we could easily, if we replace those vehicles, and then... A deselect. Come down here. Deselect. And. Sell those vehicles off. Then I think we can get this v these vehicles to go a little bit faster. Um, Dengsh to Peshwa. That's the Dengsh to Peshwa. Um. Wait, because that's Danks to Peshwa, and it's going 30 kilometers an hour. This is passenger. We can replace those and upgrade those to faster vehicles. That's only four, and it can only go 40, anywho. Um, instead of going 50 miles an hour, um, we can, let's go down to our streets. Can we... So now they will be able to go a lot faster through that road. Um, large streets, we don't need large streets, we need to find medium country road. Now, we're going to change, I don't know... Upgrading that there. So that now they can get there a lot faster um, if we decide to ever upgrade. So there from Peshwa, they're getting a lot faster 
of taking people there. Um, we could even replace these vehicles. Uh, we could even replace those vehicles with the... Can I just replace two of those? And then in order to replace those, um, it'll cost that much as well. Which, as you can see, we replaced these dank to Peshwa. Those are going to be there. Um, the bus routes. Um, if I do this, we're going to replace three of these. We're going to reduce the number... Place those. Three bus. And then this one is going to be sold off. So, anywhere, so the bus, uh, these are four bus lines. Um, we can easily replace um, the Dianka bus. Uh, these guys are, you know, the more... Um, they can only hold capacity of eight, but this is basically going to say emissions. Okay, that has more emissions than the Fuso, but I think just leaving these in town uh, is cheaper. They're cheaper. One emission is going to improve on a lot of things, but with that um so what we can do is the danky bricks um okay so this is the bricks right um okay this is right now they're using the n first truck which is only 20. Now, this is the Benz truck with side sticks, which this is taking construction materials, which I call them bricks because that is pretty much what they are. Um, if I click on view, where are you? You're... Okay, yeah, these guys are, don't need to be upgraded too much. Um, what needs to be is the quarry first. So the quarry guys, they're basically gonna... The quarry is coming from way over here. Which, they are taking uh, this kind of material. So... Uh, let's replace those. Can we replace these with something? They can go about 40 miles an hour. These guys can go about 40. Um. We're going to drop four off. And we'll actually add a fifth one in there. And then just replace. Um. I would like to... See, these are going to take 71 emission. That's going to take 70 emission. That can carry 8. But it's... Um, Ben's tank well... Is going to be able to take all cargo in general. But that's steel, planks, construction materials, logs. So the Ben's tranquil truck... Um, that's going to go 40 kilometers an hour. Um, if we go with the... This one, that's going to go 40 kilometers an hour. Can only carry six. Um, but these end in 1960, which, to be honest with you...
Okay. Um, no, this one's that oil place. So if we go over here... Um, they're over here already going from there down to there. Uh, we can... What I will do is let's check all of these. This is oil that we're taking. So we'll cut down by two. Um, place the vehicles here. Um, this is oil. So we got to make sure that, uh, that it can be um, tank truck. Remember, that's only taking seven. The tank truck here can and will take 40. Um, we could even uh, go with the oil dump and drop, but taking that even with that, I think we'll just go with I think we'll just go with the Ben's truck and then basically just to improve on the speed a little bit for him. Now, the only one that I'm... This is no oil. Um, hold on. We can we manage vehicles again? Fuel one. Those are the AFO trucks. So if we replace those, um, they're the A the. The, they're the AMFO t tank trucks. Okay. Um, I would love to go with that's the side flatbed. Um, that's the flatbed, which this is 60 miles an hour. Um, and if this is going 60, we can, we'll keep the, we'll keep what we've got going for him just to get it done a lot quicker I guess so we got forest mill here these guys um they're using the Ben's side stake trucks which is okay they're only going 40 miles an hour um anywho if we look at that forest mill this is frequency is 40 seconds if we can uh, change this to keep it um, managed vehicles, if we replace those with the 60 mile an hour um, side sticks, if we can keep the um, if we can do that's going to give us 10, 20, 30, 40, which that's only giving us seven for the Ben's Tranquil. So, you know, that's only going 40, uh, 40, uh, 7, 14, 21, 28, 35, which is, that's 10, 20, 30, 40, 7, 14, 21, 28, 35. So replace four of those with that and then... And then we'll sell you off because we don't need you. Okay. So now we got the... Uh, these guys are the, using the AN4 truck. Which, that in and of itself, if we can... Like, they're using the AN4 Tranquil truck, which is only 70 mission. Um... If we can drop down the emission by replacing tools. 
So these need to drop tools off, which we'd have to go with the flatbed. Which basically they're taking the AM4, um, the tranquil trucks. These are going to be. Those are going to be 40, but being able to replace. Just replace them with these. Just to replace them to get them a little bit faster, I guess. So, and, well, we are over... Over here. In order to improve their speed in general... Even to improve... We're gonna go here with the... Now, I'm pretty sure, I'm pretty sure if we, um, Yep. And so now having that be there as a thing for us is going to be a des is going to be improving on traffic flow and they'll go a lot faster through things like that. Um so we're just upgrading everything to the medium countryside. Um basically We're just doing that between where most of my vehicles are in general. They will eventually. Uh, like right now with them, I believe these guys are taking oil from over here. We could easily cut off that line, but I'm not going to right now. Uh, we will cut that line off soon and make that a where we're taking oil by by thing. It'll just go from here and then it'll just allow it to, uh, I don't know. So that's basically Okay, no, those don't need to be medium. They just... So, you know, we're just going to upgrade to there. Now, we do have a... Uh, since we are starting, we do have one over here. That they can get to places 
a lot quicker now. Uh, so they can get into town through that way a lot quicker. And, you know, they are taking most likely... Uh, what are these guys doing, first off? These are taking the quarry um, down to there. And then we got one that's... Peshwar. That's that Peshwar one. Um, okay, let's go back over here to... Where am I? No, that's going to be way, way up here. Okay. So, as you know, we have this train here. Here. Now, it's on the Chinani Tools, which is in about a nine-minute uh, frequency time. Now, if we go in and we say we manage vehicles, let's say... If we go with the steam train, okay, we go with the S class, we can't get the S class. Is there any, we can only go with this one here, the Russian class SCH, okay, but can we, Even, okay, so can we, uh, so I know what we need anyways. Um, let's go, let's buy vehicles. So if we buy you, okay, and then we need to go down here to cargo and we need the flat stakes. We're going to go with this one. We wouldn't have, we don't have enough money to do so. If we did one where we just add in three and then we slowly four, five, six, seven. Okay, so when it starts becoming Metacore, that's when I am going to cut out. Let's just cut out as much as I can here. I want to see if we can at least get one of those added in there. Can we add two? Okay. How about three? No, we can only add two of those in there. And then we could, we can only add two right there. So we'll buy you. Okay. Okay. So now let's go with tracks. We're just going to go with standard tracks for now. Um... It's 96. <laughs> no. Because once we get the second one. No, I was just about to build it. Just so we can get down a little bit quicker. 
Okay. Now, there's something with collusion. Okay, which means somewhere along the line... Somewhere along the line, there's com collusion. And I believe the collusion... is going to be right there found you um okay so let's go from okay so Let's go a little bit up, like, let's go up to, let's, let's go, let's make it 3,000 here. Okay. Now we've got that there, and then let's go 10,000 more. And then I want to kind of connect it. Okay, so for now, if we needed to, I can clear that out for a moment. And then... And then what I will do is just in case... I will put one... I'll put one there. And then I will also put one put it across there, but I don't like construction is not possible. But I'm doing that there so that if a train needs to go into the depot and it's on this track, it can go from either side of the depot. So now we need to work on path signaling. The signaling. Okay. So right now... Path signaling mm -hmm. and then basically. It's there's going to go path. Okay. And then we'll do one there. 
That's just in case the train, and then this. Um, and then we'll have, like, the train. Like, it can go this way, but if a train needs to, it can go this way. But we'll put a thing there. That's two ways, just because, you know, the train is going off from... Over. Then we need to set up a signal. It's two way signal there. A two way signal there. And then we will also create a two way signal there. And then after this, we'll go back and create a one way. We're just going to create a few extra signals along the path here. Because the reason why it's two-way there is in case the train needs to go in, needs to come in and go in that way. So that's why it's two-way there. Hopefully this will work the way that I wanted it to intend it to work anyway. Let's go. Whoops. Thank you. And then we will have one sit there, sit there, and then We'll put one, I'll put it a little bit fur down. No, it needs to actually sit there and then I'll put one there. Um, actually, I don't, I actually don't think I want to put one there. Um, I'm going to clear this one out as well, just because of the nature Okay, so that one's not needed there anyway. And then we should set one that goes right up to there as well, just to. Okay, and then we need to find. So that that way, then it's always one way, and then it's got that. It's got a lot of signaling from one place to another. Okay. So now we got a train that's sitting in here, um, and we edit the selected vehicle. Um, can I add an additional two side stakes to that? And set that to Shinani line. Because I thought it would, you know, it's going to go that way anyway. But I thought it would, like, you know... Like, it's still going to create it as a one-way, so it's going to have to go that way. Which I could have had the one way going this way and the other one going that way. But in true American fashion, we'd ride on the right side. But this is Asian. I don't know. I just, I'm just doing it this way, I guess. 
we have a signal that stops right there before... Because we can't have... Because, like, if trains need to go in, they would have to go in this way. Um, and then they can go out that way. But I was kind of hoping... Because the train's signaling. Without a no. And so basically I don't... I removed the signals there because I don't know... How signaling really truly does work, but eh. You guys can let me know in the comments, I guess. We got into our first set of trains. First set of train today. Um, no. Manage the vehicles. So can we, if I were to replace the selected vehicle... No, edit the selected vehicle... If I were to change this, um, we could easily get the Russian S-Class with this. Which means we'd have 150 km 15 kilometers with one train. If we add that and then remove the vehicle and set... You to the front, we would only be modifying it for this thing. Uh, so we got a higher, more efficient train now. Now remember, we can only go 120 miles an hour on this. On this. And this can only go 75 miles an hour. Edit the vehicle. <laughs> Which we don't have, we don't have the money right now to modify it. But we can, and um, they both have four on it, and we could probably, you know, having one going 120, 115 miles an hour, having them both go that much, that fast, is going to be much more efficient. Because, remember, we could, we also have these, we also have the, um, We also have this steam train here. We have a lot of, like the Russian class SU, um, which is 115, can pull, has that much power compared to this SU, you know. But we're, you know, so that's 320, 12. So the YE can pull pretty much, pretty much, if we go with the SU, um, which basically just having two different kinds of train. Uh, this is not even going to be Russian class SU. We, we got to use the SE because that's cheaper. And... Now, we need to find just the... 
Shanahi tools. Um, can we edit you? Okay. So this is saying it's still a good train. Um, cargo. Now, can we get a... I would like to see if we can get another flat stakes added on. So if we add another flat stakes, it's still going to be good. Um, I want to basically just, we're not, we don't even modify it. We'll add an additional car here. Um, just to add an additional one for each one to improve its cargo capacity. Because remember, we're receiving 48 per car. And that's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, which that's going to be... This is now going to add 60 per car. And we'll be able to, you know, that's only producing the wood. Now, we do have this. We can improve our... We can get more of these cars dropping off the wood. So, we're gonna... We got a Alapox. We got the China Type 12. We got a new gondola. And a new flatbed steak car. What? Okay, we got. We already um, addressed this. Uh, let's, the last thing I want to do is we need to find and modify... Uh, this is the Soshi South... Uh, so this is going to be basically, we need to go and find you. Where's the Shoshi Forest Mill? We're going to, can I replace these? Okay, what vehicle are you, what vehicle is this? The Gamaz M truck side stakes, right? Side stakes. So... This is a flat bag. This can carry capacity for 13 for the flat beds. If we can get more of that, this can carry 13 compared to uh, the GMA side stake, which is 10. And if we can carry 13, uh, and, yeah, if we can carry 13, we can get more in production over here. Because see, production, we can increase, we can improve the production a little bit. We might even add an additional car over here. So, yeah, last episode, guys, um, if you guys didn't see much of anything, um, I might just cut, I might just, like, uh, if we basically, can we clone a selected vehicle and add an additional one in here just to improve on its reference speed? If we look at this, this is 35 second frequency, uh, with a new vehicle in stock, which means, which means we can carry a lot more. Can we configure? Can I add, um... Which, it has 130... Our production, we want to get it to 200 to get this level increase. Um, the other ones we can, the other ones we were going to, we're going to add an additional, clone, an additional vehicle. The more, that is now 30 seconds frequency instead of 35. So we're doing definitely getting there. 
Um, we are taking it only from Sanchu Forest South, which is only transporting 48% of that. We could done it by train, but that train's going to be much more. Let's change the frequency. Let's upgrade the frequency then on this line. Um, let's go. Let's clone. Let's add two more vehicles to it. You know, if we can get down to having more vehicles along this road path, getting more, you know, yeah, they're not, we're not going to see the effects right away because they're coming, for, they have to come from over here. Um, and we might not see the effects right away, but I'm pretty sure once we do, once we do, and we have our train doing just fine. So both of those trains are running fantastically. You know, how much are we transshipping? If we're only shipping 17, transportation's doing pretty good here, but it's the production that we need to produce more in production. And we need double that. And right now we're using this one here, Susanshu South, to get delivered here. Um, we also have this one over here that we could add in an additional, a couple of those additional to get down there. But, you know, we have one here. Here. So, we are kind of, we got, well, we got even one right here that we could go straight directly from there. So, you know, that can... And that can even, we even can make tools at that factory there, which the Pew needs also tools. So if Pew needs tools, and so is, does this guy, um, we're going to use this to travel to there and just use a, we found another, um, that which takes that, which needs that there as well, which We've only got this production at the sawmill there. Um, I was kind of hoping we'd have another sawmill around, but we don't. And that's the only one that we've got. Which, I didn't realize this, but we could have gotten taken that to Pune. Um, do we got any... Okay, hold on. Do we have... First off, let's look at... Suppliers. Sapporo Mill... Is way over there. Nope. Peshwa. Sehoshi Mill. We also got the Chinahi Mill, which is right up there. Um, which they, which that can, um, and then we got the Tai, and we got Taipei and Kenoshi Mill. So the Kenoshi Mill, they don't need that there anyway. Ugh. So yeah, that's the only one that we're gonna have for it, you know. So we are making bucks. Um, where can we? Can I just repay some of that money back? Because if we could get this, we started off pretty, uh, today I started off by buying stuff. We are actually making bank guys. You know, these guys here are making, these guys are making just enough for us to fulfill that need. You know, there's going to be a little bit more than what is needed, so we could add an extra side stakes to it. Um, if we go and manage the, uh, okay, so, um, edit the train. So we do have another flatbed car, which... 
His capacity is for 18, and this is for 12. Which, okay, which we have one, two, three, four, five. We have five of those. If I were to say, okay, let's add one, two, three, four, five. Is this, uh, is this train, train one? You're carrying stuff. You are not. Okay, let's manage you instead. Train two, you have, okay, so... If we go one, two, three, four, five. Then we go one, two, three, four. We only have, we can only add two here for the flatbread with steaks. Okay. Now that means 18 plus 18. Well, well 10 plus 10 is 28, 16, which is so eight, 18 plus 8, which is 6, 12, 18, 24, 30, 36, which is actually going to allow us to only do 36 with that. Um, if we back and add two, add, uh, two of these, we still, um, right now we can we'll put the, we will, um, we will borrow We'll borrow 70,000 just so that we can modify this vehicle to add. A one, two, three to add those side stakes. And then we'll just go and add an additional. For that, that's going to give us us eight. Um, okay. So hold on. The last thing I want to do here, guys, is um, I need I need a calculator um, because I can't I can't do this in my head without a calculator, and I know and I know I can add up pretty much, but I need to take that times three, which that's going to give us fifty four for that, which is higher rated though, um, which if we do this, I am. We're going to modify the first one. That just means that we have three, which is only going to drop us by a little bit. A little bit. But that is going to allow us to go a little bit faster. A lot, a little bit faster uh, with those cars. You know, yeah... And then, So yeah, no, if we can get this a lot, see that's going to even 120, that can go up to 120 miles an hour. About 115 miles an hour, where the other one can only go up to 80. 80. That is much, much better. You know, even, even with four... So it gets there, it takes basically managed vehicle. So if we can get there a lot quicker, you know, with 54 at 115 miles an hour is a lot faster than uh, going... So, one, no, um, cancel that. So right now, as long as this train, this train can only go 80 miles an hour, okay? 
once we drop this thing off, um... Okay. So, once we drop that thing off, let's go one, two, three, four, five. Pause. Um... Need one, two, three. So, if we have three of those, that's going to give us 54 right there. Which, to be honest with you, that's going to be A-O-K. -okay. And then we'll repay, start repaying off again. Because if we can get 120 miles an hour... Uh, 115 miles an hour right now, that's actually decent for us in getting... Look at that. We're producing 90 in Shinohi Tools. Now, Shinohi Tools, we could easily split this up if we added another... And they're producing way more than what needs to be done. So we could easily just cut the train. Um, and we got another Russian class P-36. Um, so we're going to configure... Yep, and then I'm going to see if we can manage to... We're going to have to pause this. I'm going to see if we can manage to do something. See if we can manage to path... No, hold on. Um, okay, can we move you to that platform there? And then... And then, because these guys... Cause Home, Ho Chi Minh City also needs needs that as well, which needs tools. But in order for them, it has to go there, and then we can have it go to Chao Ho Chao Ma City. We could have it easily take this and just have some more planks just coming in, where we're not wasting so much of our time. I think. I think going, that's a curve, and I don't really want curves. So let's try to go, um, let's try. Okay, that's going to create a bridge, and I don't want to create bridges. Okay, because now... What we're going to do is we have one here. Now, it is going to be um, 
tracks. It is going to have one, but it's going to have one for passing. So it's technically, it's going to have one for passing. Um, because it's not going to really stay here. Um, we're going to put it the back here, I think. So that maybe it can bring in and send some more down in here where, you know, we're using cars at the moment. Um, and then we are going to go with 120 with this thing down here. Uh, let's go, let's get you connected. Okay, we only needing one there though. So let's take our track. Um, let's let the game run, I guess. And then... Okay, so right now with that, with the way that it's going, um, right now we don't have, we have no decantry, but Well, I guess 68 and 71 going into here at a station rate, I think that should be okay, right? Okay. Right now, with us going underneath the tunnel, um, we're going to have a long history of waiting. Pretty much, it's going to be like... I'm going to go there. Configure... We're going to start doing high speed a little bit just to allow it to start there. Okay. Um... And then...
and then we're gonna hit check there and then we'll put one put a check mark there so that means we're gonna set signaling up um now we have train we could easily um we have a train going there Um, so we have so we're gonna make sure that it's on this side of the track um, we need to make sure that the train station the train depot is on this side of the track which we're gonna go back far away from the, the depot uh, let's get our track this is gonna be the last thing I'm doing for today guys so we'll go we'll t check you there and the one that says too much curvature right there okay now what i will do is i will i will always put an extra check in there for it so we have that available. We also have another Russian TE and TE 3030. So if we go over here, we buy a vehicle. We do have our first. Okay. Um, all right. Um, it says, could not save game. Please check free disk space and or folder permissions. So right now we cannot save, um, and that is a slight of an issue. Um, it is being saved on another drive. Um, um, installed locally. Uh, let me, let me uninstall. Let me uninstall a couple of games here. I just uninstall a few games. Just uninstall that there. Stuff that I'm not really playing, to be honest with you. So this is the Russian T class, which can go up to top speed of 100 miles an hour with the main freight locomotive for all non-electric routes um multi-units um the multi-units are more expensive than just their single unit So, yeah, that's is why I need to get a hard drive, guys, is because I'm running out of space, and I need to clear out my main drive, all of my video folder, video stuff, um, and clear out the rest, clear out the extra folder in, in, so that I can only have games installed and stuff. And stuff. So, we will get the train in here as uh, soon. Um, we'll save, we're just going to save automatically anyways. Not save game. Um, let's just save the game to see if I see if it's. Um, we will do this one as episode three, Asia. I just do that so that I know. Um, as you can see, um, was I able to save the game? Um. Is it because I'm on the main? Can I say please check free disk space or folder permissions? Um, okay, so hold on. Wasn't isn't um manage properties. Locate file folder. So that's on the D drive. Um, 
general local files browse so if we go and I click on the browse um, that's on the D data D well that's on the D drive I find that kind of hard to believe but it might be because I am on the actual main drive so I'm gonna leave that there for today guys um and if you guys want to see more um, make sure you guys do hit that subscribe button uh, make sure you guys do hit the, that purple follow, and we will see you guys uh, later.